Wie is die Pools 2 dan, jongen? Dat weet ik niet. So, excuse us for the little uh, interruption, a little break in the connection. Not sure what happened there, but... Uh, looks like we're back online. So, a brief update on the scores. Uh, the Dutch ladies also lost their double. 3-0 win there for uh, France. The match between uh, Turkey and Sweden also ended. I'm not sure uh, what the scores are over there. So sorry about that. Score at the really important double here. Belgium against France, That's a miss for uh, for the French. Important shot. Gonna have to do that again. Probably wouldn't mind if they're gonna hit the the cushion now. And that happened. So, new chances here for uh, the French. Douze quatre. Dans le très important de doublette pour l'équipe de la Belgique contre la France, 12-4. Very nice shot, uh, Caro uh, surplus on poor l'équipe uh, France. A nice shot here from Logan Baton. Gets that ball out of the field. The fact is that uh, the Belgians need to play their third ball against only played one from the French. So, if any moment, this is a good moment for the French to uh, get back into the game. Well played by Dieter Verplanke. Very nice shot from Logan Baton.
Uh, difficult decision uh, for the French. Or difficult decision not. French uh, was a shot for point that didn't succeed it. Uh, wasn't successful. Two balls. Two balls against uh, two balls, I believe. Interesting decision. Yeah, in my opinion, when you point two balls in, maybe uh, touch the caution a little bit. Then again, the terrain is not that easy. Maybe you should keep it easy and shoot. Just two balls. And hope that the Belgians will uh, lo lose one ball with uh, pointing. Yeah, who knows. French decided to shoot the ball and succeeded. And the Belgians have a similar decision to make. Approximately 70 centimeters of space to point one in. Obviously, also be able to shoot for point. But I think they have to uh, play uh, two good bulls. And it doesn't really matter if they're deciding to point or shoot. Fact is, if you decide to point and the, the French shooter shoots a curl, they have a lot of difficulty to uh, point the second ball good. So, probably the reason uh, why uh, Logan Baton is shooting. That's not a good shot. Interesting to see what will happen now because the bull came back from boarding, so to speak. Came back and touched the bull a little bit. But still point. <laughs> so it doesn't really matter what happens. Interesting to see what Tito Verplanke will do with his last ball. Also a shot way to the right over. Missed that. So the French will have the opportunity to make uh, two points instead of just one. Slowly, maybe the French come back into the game. But no, not a point over there. Just one point for, for the French, so 12-5. Un point pour l'équipe de France, 12-5. La Belgique, la France, 12-5. Only two doubles uh, left playing. Dutch guys against the Swedish. Score over there is 12-11. Good shot, a little bit unlucky there for uh, Logan Baton. <coughs> Made that ball of uh, first, the first ball of the French uh, even better. Made shooting just a casquette. 
So he has to try and get that bull out once again. Again a hit, but it's not enough. Belgium uh, have to defend this round. Bull is behind the cautionaire, so a possible uh, bull devant is, uh, is in the game. For a difficult shot here for the French. Probably is the best thing to do here for the Belgians. Well, easier said than done. Like I said, the terrain here looks easy, but it isn't easy at all. Ball pointed by Dieter. Verplanke. On the wrong side, but very close to the cautionaire, so anything can happen with a shot. Very good shot by the French. Nice carreau. So the French uh, two balls really close to the cautionet, behind the cautionet. Uh, Belgiums only have three balls left. Uh, will decide to shoot to get some points out. Maybe shoot the cautionet because it's very close to the bulls, in front of the bulls. So, let's see what happens with that shot. Very important shot for this match. Not bad. Just a little long. Just over the cushion. Hit one of the bulls of the French team, that's good. I think the the Dutch won that last double. Also, so 3-0 for the Dutch, for the Dutch guys against the uh, Sweden. A lot of hands shaking over there. Good start for the Dutch fellas. And the referee is given a yellow card. Referee is giving a yellow card to uh, Dieter Verplanke. What I can see from here is uh, because he is uh, standing outside the circle. Or maybe it's taking too long until uh, they're playing. Not sure what's happening. Referee uh, deliberating with uh, the coach of the Belgian team. What I would say, uh, not necessary. Yellow card is okay if someone isn't in the circle. No problem at all. So only one double left. One important double left. Spain won the, their match 2-1 against Italy in that same pool. So let's see if... Uh, or France or Belgium will be the second team who won the match, the first match in the first round. It's really hard to say. The score is 12-5. Uh, Both teams are uh, playing good, Patank. Last couple of rounds, not that lucky, not that good. And also, that bowl of France, not that good. A little bit too 
too fast, played too fast. Really funny because there was really an opportunity for the French here to make a lot of points. Or a lot. Four points when they played all uh, four balls uh, good. Now they're trying to decide uh, maybe he's got a shot for uh, four points. Let's see what happens there. Very nice uh, Caro here of the French. Was a shot for four points, I think. Interesting. Uh, interesting match again. For the second uh, time, like in the triples, uh, the Belgians are in a big lead. French are coming back into the game. I think it's probably four points, so that would mean a score standing of 12 9. Last point will be measured in. Three points. So that fourth point wasn't there. So uh, just three points, 12 8 over there. That the score is the score, excuse me, Belgium against uh, France. First ball pointed in by the French. Very good. At least good enough for the Belgians to shoot that ball. For both uh, referees, uh, really uh, into this game. Yep. Ja, vooral uw Nederlandse kijkers thuis. Ik zou zeggen, kom lekker hier naartoe. Ook. Het is leuk om hier te zijn. Er zijn toch wel heel veel toeschouwers. En het niveau is dermate hoog. De sfeer is goed. De organisatie loopt ook goed. Dus ja, kom maar gezellig onze mannen en dames van het Nederlands elftal. Of Nederlands betanktal, hoeveel, viertal, aanmoedigen, want Nederlandse jongens is goed op weg, 3-0. Nederlandse dames wat minder, 0-3. Ja, dat is tegen Frankrijk, uh, is dat een excuus dan? Geen idee. Eigenlijk niet natuurlijk. Maar we weten wel dat de Franse dames uh, heel goed zijn. Onze Nederlandse dames zeker niet slecht gespeeld, uh, zo wat ik meegekregen heb uh, van deze afstand. Maar uh, niet voldoende om de Franse dames uh, te laten zwijken. Zwijken is overigens een nieuw woord. Een combinatie van zweten en wijken. Zwijken. Franse dames iets te veel ervaring om het uh, echt moeilijk te krijgen. En hebben dan ook gewoon gewonnen. 
Welcome back to this uh, very important game. And what I think is uh, three balls left for the French against four of the Belgians. Oh, that's too long. That's not good. It is. It is point. Two balls left for the French against uh, three balls for the Belgians. What to do? They're going to point. Trying to do it the other way around now. First pointing the ball in where, where they decided to shoot in similar situations. They are now deciding to point a ball in. And a really good one too. Leaving no options for the French. Maybe a little too good because the cochonet is in front of the ball. And the French would not be would not mind uh, if the cochonet will go out of the game, of course. Good shot. Wanted to shoot the Caro or something. Obviously. These kind of shots. It's a whole different thing. Again, two against one ball, so Logan Baton will uh, try to end this game with uh, two hits. That's one. Good shot. Now the French can do only one thing. Point a nice ball in on the cautionet. And then hope after the Belgium played ball that they still have point can do nothing about it but still first have to point in this ball here it comes goes over to the right but it's there it is point let's hope for the Belgians that the uh, Luga Baton will hit this ball very important shot in this first stage of the European Championship Logan Baton tire pour la gagner. Nope, uh, that's a miss. One point for the French. 12 9. Not a really good shot. Not really uh, a Logan Baton shot. Maybe a little bit of pressure, maybe uh, for the first time uh, a little bit of feeling in we can win this match here from the French. What known is as an important match. So Maybe like in the triples, the Belgium need two chances. First ball of France, a little bit long, but good enough. It's not bad at all on this uh, on this terrain. So Belgium directly decide to shoot. Very good shot. Still a little bit pissed about that uh, about that miss in the last round, maybe. And again, the referee. gets involved in the game but this time in a good way still needed to be one removed the bull was shot by Logan the baton was still in the in the field 
Good answer from the French shooter. Pointed a little long here by uh, Dieter Verplanke. Not good, can happen. Two bulls against two bulls played. So four bulls left for both teams. Tactics is uh, then uh, clear. Belgians need to point in uh, four points and hope uh, the French will uh, shoot a miss one miss or something there is room but the terrain isn't easy a little bit unlucky there for uh, for Planke. move the cut a little bit uh, the ball uh, fell uh, on a little rock probably a little bit unlucky And again, uh, maybe a difficult decision for the Belgians. They have to decide if they want to shoot the caution in or just point one, point a couple of bulls in. Think that last option is uh, the best option, and what the Belgians are also thinking: what's the best option? What the best option is? Very good. Nice ball from Dieter. So the French now have four bulls against two. An opportunity, that's for sure, here in winning this round. But with how many points is still to be determined. Good shot. Ball is in place. It could be a little bit dangerous for the Belgium. That's a nice, uh, nice pointed ball. No question about that. Pressure is high for the French. Although more bulls in the hands, they need to be hit. Now the French pointing guy has to probably hit two bulls. Oh, that's a good shot. A little bit unlucky. Casquette. The bull of Logan Baton still. At point, a little bit close to the caution. Eh? One bull against one bull. Then all of a sudden it looks a lot better for the Belgian guys. But still, if he can shoot the Corot here, they're probably saved. So, this is really close. Good shot. But a retro, another Corot. Logan Baton uh, for his second chance in winning this match has room not sure if he's gonna shoot or point but uh, I think he's gonna point yeah uh, it's like 70 80 centimeters of room his first ball uh, pointed in really good here comes that second ball a little bit uh, Far on the right side, the Belgians are looking, it's not the point. Uh, 
Again, it is not the point. Belgians are going to measure it to be sure, but it's not looking good. Really played that last ball uh, different. One point for the French. 12 10. Two chances here for the Belgian team. They didn't win the match yet. Let's go. 12 à 10 pour l'équipe Belgique. 12 à 10. Après deux changes pour l'équipe de la Belgique de vainqueur de vaincre ce match. Le parti. Ah. The first ball here of the French, a little bit too long. Of course it's point because it's the first ball. But the French not too happy about that. Both really interesting teams, that's for sure. What it feels like is like a final. Players know it's an important game. Second ball of Dieter Verplanke is a lot better. Points it in. The first ball was way too long. Opportunity, small, small opportunity for the French. Regained uh, ball advantage. Shot is not that great, but good enough. Good pointing ball. And a good enough shot. <coughs> so three balls against three balls. A lot of room. So no discussion in what to do. Could be uh, very interesting for the French. If they can shoot and uh, shoot some Kuroos. No discussion in the French team what they're gonna do. That pointed ball a uh, little bit on the left rear of the cushion. Eh? 60, 70 centimeters behind the cushion. Eh? No discussion at the French. We're gonna shoot. Again, interesting, direct interesting, because the Belgians have two balls and the French have two balls. I wonder what he's going to do. He shot the bull. Well, in my opinion, that is uh, the last option. Or shoot the cochonet, or point one in between the cochonet and the bull. 
There is room enough. If that bull is gone, there is room enough to point one in. To point two bulls in uh, by Logan Baton. So, uh, bad decision. In my opinion, is that a really bad decision? The only thing he can do now is point the bull in and hope. And it's not there, it's too short. That means that the Belgium, the Belgians have won. Yep. Belgium is the winner of this round. All right, we'll be on the break and uh, we'll be back after uh, lunch. Time schedule at this point is unknown, but I reckon uh, the team presentation will start at 2 o'clock. Around 2 o'clock we'll be back. <laughs>